since it was born in 1970, Art Basel spread around the world with edition in Hong Kong and Miami, where I am right now. Leading galleries from all over the world, they cannot miss this very important appointment for art. And Italy cannot miss the appointment when we talk about art and culture. Welcome to the Italian Affair. San Lorenzo has been always ahead of time in terms of understanding the characteristic of uh, our clients. And uh, years ago, we realized that uh, there was an overlapping on, uh, uh, on our clients between uh, purchasing of the art and purchasing of arts. So we have dedicated a strong focus on, on the art and the design world to the point that probably we're the only uh, shipyard that is completely focused uh, on uh, the world of the design. Art Basel is the capital of, of, of the art world, uh, so there was no better match for San Lorenzo of being present inside uh, of such an event. Uh, this year, for the second year in Miami, has been very successful. We had, uh, beside the presence of the Collector Lounge, every day a sunset cruise with our clients, and so far we can uh, confirm that next year is going to be possibly even better. My whole work is based about the obsession about the space. I, I've been trained as an architect and I believe that space is not only about construction, but it has its own poetic. The overall uh, experience with San Lorenzo started in a very unusual way. I received a letter from Piero Lissoni where he, he invited me to be part of this project. And also thanks to, I mean, to San Lorenzo who gave me total freedom to work on my artistical project. The exhibition that I'm presenting here in Art Basel is called 360 Horizon, which is basically an installation made of eight photographs and the intention is to keep the sense of the, uh, of the infinity, of the like, something that you can turn around and you always be part of that. I say Biren roots when I came in Italy and I begin like uh, um, modeling and uh, television career. Uh, I was focused to art because I studied art and uh, now I am in 10 years career. There are six years that I continue to uh, display my works uh, in uh, Miami Art Basel. I think pop art uh, of 60s uh, uh, it was focused on the objects of consumer world. I think my pop art is uh, different because I use the objects, icons, uh, products, uh, advertising to tell my story. So my pop art is uh, storytelling maybe, yeah. I was here in our Basel because uh, as galleries is a fantastic experience. Here in America, the interest for art is incredible. All our Italian artists start from an historical background. Here in our Basel, I'm representing two artists, two Italian artists, and uh, the name is the one Eduardo Menini. He is a 65-year-old artist. All colors are self-made by him with pigments. All frames are self-made, uh, uh, he studied all kind of uh, collage uh, with all material. Then the other one is uh, Angelo Brescianini. Angelo Brescianini died uh, two years ago. He was a genius because he started uh, painting as Caravaggio the church. Then uh, for 10 years uh, he experimented uh, to shot because he wanted to join light and movement with only movement. So they shot by, with the rifles, and the pistols. Art in every form, pure love. This is Art Basel. The Italian Affair will be back soon. Arrivederci.